Hey guys, I'm Abby and Lorianne's my dog. Today I have four sets of colored pencils here and I want to compare them. This is my first set. It is the expensive set, the Holbein pencils, and then I have three sets of colored pencils from Daiso. Two sets of 12 pencils and then one set of 20 pencils. Now I'm curious to see how the 20 set will be because that's a lot of pencils. Anyway, here they all are, and I'm gonna start by swatching them. I made these little swatch palettes. I'm starting with the Holbein pencils, and these are my favorite pastel pencils. They color in very nicely, they're very opaque, and they are pastel colored, so it's a little bit different color scheme than the ones I got from Daiso, but for the purpose of this video, I decided to use these. Now I'm moving on to my second set, and this is the box set of 12, and I ended up really liking the colors in this set, and I definitely would use them for future shrink plastic pieces. For the third set, we have the bagged set of 12, and these colors I would say were very basic or standard, but super vibrant. Out of all three sets, this was the most vibrant. Now, we have the set of 20. I will start off by saying I was disappointed in these because I was really excited. I was like, 20 colors for a dollar, that's great. But as you can see here, this one barely showed up and kind of sad. So I had to split up the 20 here. You can see them on the far right. I'll show you the swatches later, but here they are. Of course, the Holbein one is the most opaque and pretty, but the other two sets of 12 aren't bad. I will say that. Now. For comparison's sake, I am going to make four rainbows here and have the Holbein, and then the bag set of 12, and then the box set, no, the box set of 20, and then the box set of 12. So I'm gonna color these in with rainbow colors, and I made sure to find a rainbow with seven colors. And so the pastel one, of course, isn't, you know, a vibrant rainbow, but I still use the seven colors, so. They're joining in this comparison. <laughs> Here is the 12 bag set. Like I said, they had the most standard colors, so it's very rainbow. Like the seven colors that I needed were in this set and they worked out really well. But again, like I said, the bag set of 12, I really liked the colors in these. And while the blues were a little bit off because it was more of a teal, the colors kind of blend together, I feel like. They kind of match each other compared to the bag set. But the bag set was more vibrant, so you win some, you lose some. Anyway, this 20 set, I don't know, the pencils themselves, when I was coloring with them, they, well, first off, they were a lot skinnier than the other pencils. That's okay, I mean, 20 for a dollar, sure. But they also were very powdery, but not pigmented, so this is what I ended up with. And as you can see, it gets more and more vibrant. So, you can decide which one you think is the best. I mean, it's kind of obvious, but... Anyway, I am going to finish these up. I just used a white Mitsubishi pencil from a random set of colored pencils I had because the white that came in the set of 20 was no good. Finish that up, I'm gonna take my Posca paint marker or chalk marker as I like to call them. I mean, I guess the same thing. And do the outline and then cut them out and then we're going to shrink all these guys down. Can't forget about the swatches. I cut them out by set and you can already kind of see which ones are looking good. It's not the set of 20. <laughs> anyway, here they are back from the oven and as you can see, these turned out really opaque. And then this is the 12 box, which I said I like the colors, right? And then the 12 bag is the vibrant one. And then we have the 21, which is a little bit sad looking, I will be honest. And then the swatches, these look so good. I just wanna swatch everything I own now on shrink plastic because these are really fun. Anyway, this is a set of 20 and while it is the saddest all out of the four, they did come through once shrunken down. Then here's the Holbein. I would love to get my hands on some of the non-pastel colors and see how they work on shrink plastic. And then of course we have the box and 
bagged set of 12, which I kind of equally love because they're different colors. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye!